Hey everyone, this is Bremster, and this is the next Sudoku problem in my Sudoku problem series. This is another one by me. Um, this is an easy one. I've been getting some hard ones recently, and I wanted to do an easy one for people. Uh, this is a diagonal Sudoku problem, um, and the way diagonals work is that along the indicated diagonals, so both the, uh, the what is called the positive diagonal and the negative diagonal, um, because that's the way that they would go on a graph if you were to uh, mark them off, um, then uh, the, you also cannot repeat the digits 1 to 9. So they must also contain a set of the digits 1 to 9 without repetition, um, as well as the normal Sudoku, Sudoku rules. So um, the goal, of course, is to find the digit that goes into the cell marked with an X, in this case, row 5, column 5. Um, you can give this a shot on the link below if you need to, or you can try and do this one in your head. Um, I'm going to be back in a couple of seconds to explain how this one works. Okay, so um, as we said, um, the because you must put a um, a complete set of the digits one to nine on each uh, diagonal, we can see down up here in box one, you cannot put one, two, or three into those cells, and you also cannot put one, two, or three onto this diagonal in box nine. So these cells right here must contain the digits one, two, and three. However, this diagonal already has a one and a two on it, so you cannot put a one or two here, and this becomes a three. Very, very easy um, puzzle or problem. Problem, but the the reason this is very very important diagonal logic that you see a lot where you have digits that are in both boxes that are, or two boxes that a diagonal touches which forces it onto the diagonal in a different one and because this is such a fundamental um, piece of logic with diagonals I thought it was worth covering so hopefully experienced solvers were able to do this one in their head in a couple of seconds, I imagine. But uh, hopefully this is useful to people who haven't done a lot of diagonal Sudoku. Thanks everyone for watching. Hope you're enjoying the series. And as always, good luck with your solving.